I turned my head to look behind me and suddenly there was a gloved hand over my mouth and a knife to my face and the man said, if you scream, I will kill you. He dragged me across the busy street and there's a lot of dense shrubbery in this area. And I thought to myself, he's going to rape me, he's going to kill me, and it's gonna be a long time before someone finds me there. He proceeded to blindfold me. I couldn't see out, but I could see down. And I saw that he put down the knife. So I grabbed the knife with both hands and I stabbed him with it. I plunged the knife in until I could feel the bottom of my fists hitting his skin, and I just tore. I heard him running away. I pulled the blindfold down around my neck, and I began running. Two guys had pulled up in a car, and they looked at me, and he said, one of the guys said, we're here, we're going to help you. The police received a call from one of the local hospitals that stated that there was a male in their emergency room seeking treatment for stab wounds. They were quite certain that that was the man that had attacked me, and they arrested him. I survived because I trusted my gut instinct to try anything I could to get out of that situation. That night, he was looking for another victim that night, he got a fighter instead.